All right, everyone, welcome back. My name is Faux Showshot, and we're going to be checking out Tell Me Why. Um, saw this is on Xbox Game Pass now, and I've never actually played uh, Life is Strange. This is made by the people who made Life is Strange, so uh, I'm interested to see how this one is. Uh, uh, so let's just jump in with new game. Tell Me Why is a story-based game that takes your choices into account to shape your... And I read it all day on. That's okay. We get it. It's a story-based game. You make decisions, and that's just what we gotta go through. Delos Crossing, Alaska. March 1st, 2005. This is very loud. I thought I turned it down. Hey, kiddo. I need to ask you a few questions, okay? Can you tell me what happened tonight? I... I went to show her my haircut. She had a gun. She... Take your time. She freaked out. I... I... It's okay. No, it's not. It's not okay. My mom tried to kill me, so... So I stabbed her. I killed my mother. Oof. Starting out heavy. Chapter 1, Homecoming. Fireweed Residence Residential Center, November 2nd, Am I okay, jumping in? First, I'm gonna find the keys to the old house. Then, I'm gonna drive to Fireweed and I'm not going to freak out. Everything's fine. Okay, playing as Allison. 
like that music. Let's do a little bit farther down. Let's keep voices as they are. I should probably get rid of this. I mean, I can stream it anytime I want. Journey it, through the stars. It makes me happy just like to look at the box. Uh, examine. Let's see what she was writing. No. In my desk drawer, maybe? To do. Gift. Itinerary. Snacks and drinks. Car keys. House keys. All set. I think. Still need to find those damn house keys. Dallas News, Police Chief Brown asked council to reconsider budget. Doc strike to begin this week. Mayoral election, candidate Tom Vecchi supports gun control. Money for local schools. I should probably check my email one more time before I go. No, I've already done that three times this morning. Why are you checking your email so much? Time and I against any two. The shape of yesterday. Summertime sweet. Hockey. Michael and Tyler are so gonna hit it off. It's gonna be so crazy to see him after all these years. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see. What else? This whole episode is just going to be me looking at every single thing Not in this here. room. Night Watch I've Alaska. I've got to make solid plans to see the Geminids. I wonder if Tyler would want to go. What are the Geminids? Is this something that hey, everybody knows? Hey, you want to freeze your ass off watching burning rocks fall through the sky? Yeah, I might need to work. Oh, right. I stashed them down here. Are they meteor? Is it a meteor shower? That'd be pretty cool. I've only seen, I think, like two meteor showers in my life. <laughs> so that's where you've been hiding. The hell was that thing? Ah, I wanted to look at the picture. Hopefully I get another chance. Ooh, is it gonna not let me? All right, I think I'm ready to go now. No, you need to look at that picture. Oh, dang it. All right, well. One more season. What am I even gonna do with myself when it's over? Get invested in the lives of real people? Why didn't it let me... I don't really have time to dig through this right now. Allison... Roman? Probably not gonna see any stars at this time of day. Probably not gonna see any stars at this time of day. I could look at this artwork all day. It's literally, it's just a picture of Martha. That's not even that great of one, but you know, Everyone's own cup of tea. I've been practiced since high school. I'm probably super rusty. Uh, doo -doo -doo. I think that's probably everything. So she's a space nerd. Uh, Allie, she's going to be so awkward. <laughs> what? Yeah, uh, let me read that. Dear Tyler, I know what you're thinking. A letter? Why all weird and formal? What's wrong with email? Well, I figured, hey, bro, just wanted to give my twin a shout before reuniting after 10 years of swank juvie. It's more like letter territory. Whatever. You'll thank me when we're 90 and the machines have taken over and you still have something to read by candlelight. See? Always thinking ahead. Anyway, I can't believe you'll be out for real in a few weeks. What? Amazing. 
I'm definitely going to be awkward when I see you, so please try not to notice, okay? How's your last month going? Are you sad about leaving your mentees? I bet they're going to miss you. I got my tires replaced, so I'm all good to pick you up. And you can save the snark when you see my ride. She's been through a lot, and we can't all be car guys. Anyway, the veggies let me take the day off so we can go straight to the old house and get it ready for sale, for the sale and everything. Can't wait to never think about that place again. I really can't wait to see you. I don't know what, I don't know if I made that clear. Smiley face. Love you. Allison. That's sweet. So this guy was in ju Juvie, I guess? Can't believe I'm about to leave this room for the last time. Okay. I'm pretty much done here. Seems like I just need to grab my goblin and I'm off. Decent juvie. Oh, love you, Ty. I miss these dumb dumbs. You escaped. Yeah, yeah. Candace. Yeah, yeah. Candice. Good work or good luck. See you soon. We'll miss you later, Tyler. Did they just all come in here and put that on? Man. The soundtrack to my angsty teen years. I'll leave it for the next rebel. They're gonna need. <sighs> Bombed, I have to leave this behind. But the old house would probably collapse if I blasted this inside. Been listening to this on a loop lately. Oh, all right. Fireweed Youth Center Student Art Show at Grindhouse. Tyler Ronan 20 matches young. Lingit artist with favorite local venue. Shit I gotta do. Tutoring. Help Perez with college admission essay by end of the week. Call Dr. Beck. Re counseling sessions with Jeremy. Meet Aaron. Gardening program setup. Uh, finish paperwork for escape. We'll escape W2 and letter November 2nd. Something for Allison. I don't know why I clicked Q on that. I could have just actually read that one. I know most of these by heart at this point. I wish I could have finished this before I left, but God, it was a slog. <laughs> hey, little guy. You're going to be reunited with your sister soon. Oh, they both have one of those things. Okay. Cool. I guess I'm totally ready to go. Bye, Herbert. Herbert. Celebrate, educate, unite. Trans visibility march on June. On June, March 31st, 2014, 5:30 p.m. To late. Brought to you by Juno Coalition for Equality. Is that Juno? Is that? You stay here. Educate the youngsters in classic cinema. Denali. I need to get my application ready for next summer. Take me. This box of junk treasure is now yours by the first law of finders keepers. Am I going to take it? I don't know. I'm leaving it for the other people. Uh, testosterone refill. TRX. Hmm. <laughs> hey, Aaron. You know I'm bad at this, but just wanted to say you've been the best counselor and at risk yet redeemable youth. Haha, <laughs> could want. Thanks for putting up with me and helping in more ways than you know. I'll try to make it count outside of fireweed. Survival is rebellion. Thanks, man. Tyler. So is that a counselor? Mm, all right, let's hit it out. Please give me water and sunshine. Next 
acts like he hasn't been outside. She threw the bear out? Well, that's littering, and two, I mean, could have gave it to somebody else. Hi, Tyler. Hi. First time we see each other in ten years, and it's hi, Tyler. Oh, sorry, I... It's fine, Allison. Hi is a good place to start. God, it's good to see you. <sighs> Likewise. You have anything else you need to get? Nope. This is it. My last ten years in a bag. Then we should get going. We just have time to make the morning ferry. You look good in that. Thanks. One of my mentees designed it. It's really good. Yeah, he's so incredibly talented. I got a couple of local coffee shops to hang his art. Tyler Ronan, shaping the leaders of tomorrow. Yep, we're screwed. <laughs> so, are you gonna miss anything about this place? Yeah, I'll say the people. Honestly, the people. The other residents, my mentees, my counselor, Aaron. It took me a while to fit in, but once I did, it felt like home. They made me feel safe. Safe enough to be me. That's so great. I'm really happy for you. We planning to drive to Delos Crossing or push? You are welcome to walk. Nah, I'll take my chances. Need one last look or anything? Looked. Let's go. I feel like his voice is like a little too young for his like... His character model. Look at that achievement. Really, I am 100% not creative enough to make that stuff up. Oh, and just last week, they had to turn the ferry around because a bear was on board. No way. Someone heard a commotion in the back of a delivery truck, so they opened it up. And there was the bear, fat and happy on a literal mountain of empty chip bags. <laughs> you go where the food is. Oh, I can relate to that. So then what happened? I'm not sure. I think they couldn't get him to leave, so they tranked him. Oh, poor buddy. Shot in the ass just for getting the munchies. Yeah, well, you know what they say. Safety first in bear country. Yeah, but prevention is best. Common sense goes a long way in keeping them from getting shot. The bear is fine, Tyler. For now. You hear they've been talking about loosening up regulations on trophy hunting again? Higher bag limits, inhumane ground traps, even bringing back hibernation hunting. What kind of asshole gets off on killing a sleeping animal? I'm not against hunting, but predators play a vital role in the health of our natural parks. What? Why are you smiling? I'm being serious. Oh, I can tell, Ranger Tyler. Not yet, but at least I got the school part out of the way. I can't believe you've got a bachelor's already. While I boast a half-completed certificate in accounting from an online college that may have stolen my credit card number. You'll figure out what you want. You have time. How are you feeling? Like I'm about to drive straight into a whiteout and my fog lights are dead. I hate fairies. I'm gonna take a couple. I had a good amount in my life, and what about I'm, you? I'm just not a fan of them. Allison? Well, zoned out there for a second. Sorry. What's up? I'm sorry. I'm just trying to wrap my head around the fact that you're right here, standing beside me, on our way to Delos. You don't have to apologize. It's a lot.
I'm guessing things haven't changed much. You mean in Delos? Still the capital of East Jesus nowhere. Can't wait to get out of here. Was it really that bad? Pretty much. But it could definitely have been worse. Like if you'd been tucked away in a center for troubled youth? Right. At least you had Michael. Yeah. I don't think I'd have survived high school without him. Bet you're gonna miss him when you move to Juno. How's he doing? Good. Good, good. Uh, but I haven't seen him much outside of work lately. He's been busy with his dance and helping his clan organize a potlatch. Is that smoke coming out of Stonehouse? Guess someone finally bought that old shack. That, or the ghosts are cozying up by the fire. Think the new owners know it's totally haunted? I'm sure Tina did her best to keep them from figuring it out. At least until the paperwork was signed. Ugh. That house always gave me the creeps. Those windows are like huge gawking eyes. Uh, you think people talk about our house this way? Probably. Just being a realist. Very, so, very good looking. Really thing. going back there, huh? To Stonehouse? I mean, we're going home. Yeah. Yeah, we are. Think the house will sell? No interested buyers yet. Turns out people don't line up to buy murder houses with no electricity. <laughs> At least it's got one hell of a view, unlike Juno. Hey, Juno has mountain views aplenty. It just also has people and fun. You still thinking you might be my roomie? I'm thinking about it. Hey, can I ask you a question? Shoot. I was told... Um, I mean, after you, well, graduated, I guess, and became a mentor three years ago, you still basically spent all your time at Fireweed, right? Pretty much. There were a few times I tried to go to these meetups for trans people in Juno, but something always came up. I probably should have put myself out there more, but it was better to be around in case the residents needed me. So you were free to come and go as you pleased? Yeah. Uh, why do you ask? Oh, nothing. Just being an overly invested sister. Curious how you spent your time. Oh. So he's trans. And also, he is the one, I'm assuming the child, from the beginning? Who had to stand as Allison. mom? Yeah? Spit it out. Okay, you need to promise not to freak out. What is it? It's a gift. From Eddie. I know he's not your favorite person, but... I'm sorry, when you said Eddie, I thought you meant Chief Brown, as in the police officer who arrested me. Come on, Ty, don't... And your adopted father, the man who didn't let you visit me for seven years. The Fireweed Administration backed him up, Tyler. They thought it was best for both of us. Yeah, well, it wasn't. It's a peace offering, and you're the two most important people in my life. Please, for me... He can't buy my forgiveness with some cheap-ass trinket. It's a gift, Tyler. You know what gift-giving means in Clinket culture, and what it means to refuse one. Clinket? Um... I mean, the guy... I don't know the whole story right now. I'm gonna go... Oh, that's not what I wanted. I know this is weird. Oh, I just didn't say anything. But Uncle Eddie's my family. He put up with me at my absolute worst, and has always been consistent and kind. Oh, she just talked to me. Okay, I still get it. Um, let's go with I can't accept this. I can't accept this. I'm just not there yet. All right. 
You gonna mope about that for the rest of the day, or what? I just hoped you might make an effort, that's all. An effort? It's an effort not to punch something whenever you say his name. Can't you just cut him a break? He was doing the best he could with a truly shitty situation. Did you hear that? I'm a jerk. You just always need to have the last word. In other words, a jerk. I didn't need to dig in like that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. I just hoped we could wrap everything up with a grand gesture and move on to our perfectly normal lives. What? This isn't normal? <laughs> Still your brother? Still your sister. Would it ruin the moment if I said I needed to call home? Uh, yes. Completely. Sorry. Go ahead. And stop apologizing all the time. Okay, sorry. <sighs> Thanks. It's so weird being back on this boat. Just look in other people's shit. Impressive, ain't she? You planning to land a moose with that? Good eye. You ever tried bow hunting? <laughs> no. What worked for Grandpa works for me. Wonder if there'll be time to hit the buzzard hole while I'm here. You've got all your bases covered, don't you? You betcha. <laughs> Whatever Charming. Else fails, try doing what the captain suggested. Where are you headed? Uh, Delos Crossing. Same here. You from around here? Just in town for a few days. I see. Any relatives in the area? My sister. And she's moving soon. This a goodbye trip, then? <laughs> Something like that. I'm Alex, by the way. Alex Gershwin. No relation. Huh? To George Gershwin. Um... Gershwin, the pianist. Folks are always asking if we're related, so I try to hit it off in the past. Oh. Uh... What'd you say your name was? Just call me Tyler. All right. Good to meet you, Tyler. Likewise, sir. Hey, Allison, can we take the scenic route instead of the highway? Allison? I don't think she can hear you. <laughs> Guess not. Denali expedition. One day soon, I hope. Crown Jewel of Alaska. Now open, do drop in, bed, at breakfast. House has walk-in freezer and space for deer and fish processing. Uh, canoe for sale, strong and sturdy. Fiberglass transform for five fifty-four p outboard. Five hundred dollars includes oars. No bargaining. Call or text. 
Introduction to Making Devil's Club Tea. Our way of life, community, and cultural programming sponsored by Una Heritage Foundation. Learn how to harvest and process Devil's Club to make tea. Sign up today. In Delos Crossing on Sunday, June 19th. Contact A. Wilson Ave. Blah, blah, blah. Sign up. Space is limited to 20 participants per class. There is no substitute. Protect our only home. What, uh, what did they, how did they pronounce that Chingit dance performance? There's a dance group that celebrates ancestry nutrition. We invite you to join us for inner invitational drumming, singing, and dancing. Come share and celebrate our culture. Free and open to the public. Gastineau High School Winter Formal. Gastineau Winter Formal? Gastineau. Fancy. Wait. Wasn't that Allison's high school? Suit up. I mean, I'm sure that was like a tough thing that that police officer to do, but like if he was telling the truth. What a waste of a good point. And that Remain in vehicle and notice. Remain in vehicle while ferries dock. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um. So he just like sent a ten-year-old to prison. Not prison, juvie. For that. That's kind of messed up. Here's my sport. Check my six pack. <laughs> Hilarious. Let's see what I say. Headshot. Crime control. Let's go. Back to the car, Ronan. It's basically exactly like I remember it, only faded. Like a Polaroid left on a windowsill. From the outside, it almost looks charming. Charm's not the problem. Structural integrity may be an issue. You think there's a chance whoever buys it will just tear it down? If someone buys it, they can do whatever they want with it. You wouldn't care at all? 
Would you? Sure. Everywhere I look, I see a piece of one of our adventures. Everywhere I look, I just see her. Allison, we could go grab a bite. Start this tomorrow? No. The only way to get this done is to do it. After you. Alright, so this is the house where we grew up. Or I guess the first ten years. Right, we're twins? Is that what it was? I don't know why. I'm... My brain is just like, oh, I have to search everything and get everything. Marianne always spoiled the birds. She liked animals way more than people. I can Mar relate to that. Marianne, is that... Is that their mom? Hey, you remember that? Come on, Tyler. It's freezing out here. You're right. Sorry. Let's head inside. Ugh, I really just want to go around this whole house just looking at everything before, but let's just, let's you, you know, sake of the story. Not being a completionist. Let's just uh, check it all out. I need to look through this window uh, first. Did you smoke something before you left Fireweed? The door's right there. <sighs> yes, yes. Locked. Well, it's a good thing I remember this. You sure that's the right key? Yes. Maybe someone changed the lock. Who would change the lock on us? I don't know. We're screwed. You got a plan B? Yeah. We find another way in. Well, I never knew a locked door that could keep the crafty goblins out. Yeah, we had a million ways in and out of this old house. At least one of them's gotta work. <sighs> the crafty goblins. I haven't thought about them in forever. Or should I say, us. We almost spent more time as goblins than we did as kids. Oh, do you remember all the other characters? The moon hag, the ice king, the old bear. Most of them, I think. But the details are fuzzy. Hey, do you know what happened to the book with all the stories? No, no idea. But I'm sure it'll turn up when we clean this place out. Doesn't seem like the greenest source of energy. Not like she had the money for solar panels. At least we don't have any use for this right now. Storm in 2004, Marianne had us digging for hours. I remember she made it a game at least. That's right. We made tunnels to escape the ice troll. I gotta hand it to her. She can make us do anything if she turned it into a goblin tail. Alright, no luck on that. Open sesame. Let me guess. It's locked. Yup. Know any other secret passwords? Hmm. Honeydew? <laughs> nope. Well, try the key on this lock. Maybe this is still the old lock. Come on, guys. Alright, I guess I'm gonna kick out the boards, go through the crawl space. Uh, no, it should be fine. Okay. <sighs> if we just get this board out of the way, I could probably squeeze through. So we need something to pry it off. It's screwed in pretty good. We need a screwdriver. Maybe this area. Oh. I can't believe these are still here. These yeah. are pretty cool. We should hide them so they don't frighten away potential buyers. Well, it does look sick. At least the shed's still standing. Yep. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it, though. Well, better alive than dead. Ugh, yes. Let's deal with that later. Plenty else to do. It's locked, all right. 
Oh my god, everything. Everything's locked. Okay. Should be something in here that'll work. Hey, I see a screwdriver. Now all we need to do is get inside. Wait, I, um... I'm feeling something strange. Focus. And don't leave this room until everything looks as clean as a whistle. Ugh. This is the millionth time I've gotten in trouble because of you. You and your big mouth. Hey, you were thinking the same thing. You just weren't brave enough to tell her. What good would it do? It's not like she ever listens to us anyway. Well, I'd rather scream it right in her stupid face than be a quiet little mouse. Oh, we forgot the key. We need to put it back. Maybe we could hide it somewhere. You know, for fun. Goblins are supposed to help the princess, not play mean tricks. Whatever, you're not fun. I'm only trying not to make her even worse. Whoa. Did that just happen? I don't know, but I saw it too. It Wait, felt like it what? did when we used to share thoughts with our voice. It did, but that was a memory of us 10 years ago, right? What? I vaguely remember it happening. I think so. And uh, that's new, right? Yeah. We could share thoughts and feelings, but we never replayed memories like that. Why would it happen? And why that memory? I don't know. It's pretty eerie. It's weird, but our voice was always a good thing. This could be too. I'm feeling something again. Near the barn. Yeah, me too. Superpowers. All right. All right, guys, I think that's where I'm going to pause it uh, today. Um, so thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it. And, uh, I really like this. Uh, very interesting. Wasn't expecting the whole uh, superpower, you know, twin thing going on. But uh, that's pretty, pretty awesome. Uh, I'm definitely going to keep playing this. I'll be putting out more parts, probably one tomorrow. Might take a break for Christmas. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoy and have a wonderful day. Thanks.